Hey guys, this is a quick proof of concept video for the second prototype of my iRacing button box. The design is open. Uh, you can find the plans on GitHub. Uh, links are going to be in the video description below, or you're going to find details on the iRacing forums. Um, the case is 3D printed. Uh, the faceplate comes with four dedicated buttons on the top row. Those are just simple push buttons. Uh, four toggle switches in the middle. One more toggle switch down here and three rotary encoders with integrated buttons as well. Um, the encoders are really great for navigating the menu. Um, this one here is set up... Whoops, let me just get focus here. Sorry. Uh, this one here is set up to open relative F3 and then you can uh, navigate the black box from here just by turning the knob and just goes left, right, whichever way you select. Um, the next one here, same thing, up, down, within the menu. And then this one here, you can change, adjust values, uh, as you see fit. Uh, pushing these two will just toggle the select. Um, they both have the same function right now, but these can be programmed. Um, the other switches over here uh, have dedicated functions. Um, up here, the ignition switch. If I hit this, you're going to see the dashboard light up, and the engine will start here in a second. Um, if I press it again, it's going to go off. Uh, really great during DG3 races, during the start, when you're just sitting on the line waiting for people to join. Just turn your engine off, you're not wasting fuel, um, which means you can just take a little less fuel during the pit stop. Really good thing. Uh, other switches, let me just get rid of this one here. Click, gone. Um, sorry, typical, things. okay. Escape, hold it, just like an iRacing, boom. You're out of the car. Let me get back in. Um, the other ones, let me get into the menu. Brake bias up, brake bias down. ABS, um, settings right here. Six, up, seven, down. Traction control right here. Six, seven. And it will also show in your display, of course, um, but I just have the engine turned off right now. Uh, you could also just use these encoders here to change the values. Um, Get rid of this, and then down here I have the dedicated pit stop. Just toggles the pit stop uh, pit limiter. Um, up is not assigned yet. Uh, this side is free as well. All the um, the device acts as a standard USB keyboard, and all the keys that it sends can be configured in a, a config file. It's just a few settings. You can tell it to use a modifier key like the shift key on your keyboard. Um, so you say shift four will then be just like hitting the shift key on your keyboard and the number four. Um, again, please visit the uh, GitHub website, link is below for uh, plans, uh, instruction manuals, or visit the iRacing forum if you want to see a few more uh, details, get more information about this little device. Uh, very easy to build, uh, 3D printer case. It's about a, takes about a day to build this thing. So really simple, uh, neat little project. So have fun, guys.